Hello there, Adam Bazalgette here, founder of Scratch Golf Academy, three-time PGA Teacher of the Year. Instead of the usual golf lesson today, I want to share with you some big plans for Scratch Golf to really round out your experience and help you this year and going forward. Proud to announce the addition of two fantastic experts at different parts of the golf industry that are going to be joining us at the channel, bringing you content and again helping round out your golf experience. You'll meet one of them next time, but in today's video, you're going to meet uh, a guy that's just terrific in his industry, all things equipment we're going to him for. So let's meet him right on the other side of the break. Well, very briefly, if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed before, we have big plans this summer and in the coming years to bring you content. Hit the subscribe button and the little bell next to it. You'll be notified every time one of these new videos is coming out. Thanks for your support. All right, well, Rob Cusick is going to be our go-to guy on all things equipment. He's a PGA professional, a master club fitter, has a lot of accomplishments. Rob, without further ado, come on over Certainly. there. Adam, Good to have you as always. I've known this guy a long time. <laughs> So uh, tell us just a little bit about yourself, a couple of the certifications. Yep. So I'm a uh, PGI, uh, PGA certified professional. Uh, worked my way uh, last couple years and I got my, my coaching and teaching certification. Mm -hmm. um, I'm a certified through a lot of different club manufacturers. Callaway, uh, TaylorMade, Ping, uh, Titleist. Uh, with Titleist, we're actually one of the only advanced fitting centers in Southwest Florida. So, uh, so you've been doing this club fitting thing for many, many years. Of, I've yeah. watched ten of them myself. So. <laughs> and even outside of just clubs and, and and the heads, right? I'm also certified with a couple different shaft companies too. Okay, great. So you know, trying to um, get that broad scope and and dive into everything that we can. Terrific. Now. I'm going to put you on the spot and ask you a few questions if you don't mind. First thing, I mean, the first I'd say is what do you hope to bring in the coming year and the coming years or willing to Scratch Golf Academy to the YouTube audience? I think it's uh, a little bit more about cutting out some of that marketing fog, right? Kind of trim away what, uh, you know, every, every time when a new driver comes out, it's five yards, ten yards, how much longer can it be? We'll start to compare some things year to year. Um, but also about different irons and wedges and, and yeah. putters uh, that are out there. If we can tell you, hey, look, Maybe after 100 rounds of golf, it's time to look at a new wedge. In that wedge, what do I look for? Well, there's wedges out there, you know, all the same loft of a 56 degree, mm -hmm. but could have different bounce angles. And, and, and one company uh, with a bokeh wedge, they have about four or five different bounces mm -hmm. on that one wedge. Which one is best for you? Right. And I'll try to explain and, and show you which, which each can do. What the pros, what are the cons, you know, of each one, and, and, and hope to, to guide you in the right Equipment way. Equipment comes out all the time, and uh, I mean, you see it as well. And it's good stuff, and there are technological advances, but it's not all things to all people, so you need to be discerning, and that's where, again, we're bringing Rob in to let you have some wisdom and knowledge to make good decisions on that, and how to put your set together. We actually did a whole course back at Scratch Golf in our off-season program, and a section of that is on personal club fitting, customizing your own set, which is a great thing. So. It's not the first time we've worked together a little no. bit, but I think this is going to be exciting. So how about a couple of personal questions, right, just silly nice. questions. Nice, how about, yeah. Okay, how about what's the lowest score you've ever shot? Uh, 67. Now, we're going back uh, when I used to play a, a lot more. Uh, but no, 67 was, has been my low, and uh, a couple kids have gotten in the way now. Oh, yeah. So that kind of that kind of pulled me down a, blessing, a little but bit. They don't always help the handicap. <laughs> how about hole in one? Have you had a hole in one? I have. I have. I have a, just one hole in one, uh, and it was a pitching wedge, and I slam dunked it. No okay. bounce, no Great roll, stuff. just jarred it. Well, before we get to go, just tell us what do you think are the most common errors? Would the people obviously buying equipment, right. amateur golfers, what are right. the most common pitfalls of thinking that they get into? I'd say if we're if we're starting from the driver, right? Everybody comes out and they say, "I want more distance. I want right. driver, driver, driver." And maybe in those drivers, it's a little more uh, in the vanity lofts, right? And and always saying, "I want to hit it lower," and, you know, and get right. it down. No, we can we can do more with a little loft, but stepping out of that, right? And maybe that's where people think. Club fitting is just about driver, like right. I was saying before. No, irons and wedges and, and new putters. Putters out there that are, are much more forgiving and yeah. have much more alignment aids. You know, these are things that can that can help us out and we can get fit for. Okay, great. Well, I think this is going to be exciting. I think it's going to help fill out your golf experience. We're really pleased and proud to have Rob with the channel. So please hit the subscribe button. That's if you're not right. a subscriber to Scratch Golf, you'll be notified not, when my, not only when my videos come out, but when Rob's equipment reviews and other tips on equipment, these are going to be really helpful to you, I'm yeah. confident, uh, come out and hit the little bell there next to that. 
because then you, you'll actually be notified, you won't just get them. So get that free content, get to know what's going on in the world of equipment so you can have more fun in your game. Again, Rob, thanks very you got much. It. You got to see you around.